the time before we get launched into what Pastor Joel has to say today. We want to make sure you all know what's going on in the life of our church. I'm Gigi. This is Holly. Good morning. Actually, this is Holly Boo Boo Dancing Queen. <laughs> Woo! All right, so if you're listening, say I am. All right, hey, listen, if it's your first time here, welcome to the family. We're so glad that you are here. I gave a little bit of a welcome earlier, but I just want you to know that we are so excited that you're here. Don't stand so far away from me, Holly. I took a shower this morning. Did, I did too. Sundays are shower <laughs> And I put day. deodorant on. Oh, anyways, so we are glad you're here, and we would love to know that you were here and that it was your first time. So if you would, there's a connect card in the seat back in front of you, and um, I guess we can just drop those off. Normally, we'd put those in the offering buckets, so we'll, you know, logistical things of new service flow. But please, you can bring it to me. You can bring it to Miss Holly. You can bring your connect cards to anybody that was on this stage, and we'll make sure that they get to where they need to go so that we can say howdy and thank you for coming. All right, Holly. Yes, ma'am. Can you please let us know where the bathrooms are? Oh, absolutely. The ladies' bathrooms are to uh, my left, your right. Men's bathrooms are to my right, your left. These doors here are not bathrooms. So uh, do not go through them, okay? If you do not have children, you don't need to be back there. So yeah, we those are for make... kiddos. Those are for the kiddos only. Oh, yeah, only, only if you're volunteering. If you're volunteering we ask that you not go through these two doors unless you're volunteering with our kiddos just to keep them safe and also keep them focused because they're learning about Jesus in their way. All right, guys, we have our worship in the park is coming up in August, and we are gathering school supplies for that. Miss Holly, do you have the details on that? I, Give us the details I'll on that. I'll tell you what, I really don't have the details. Oh, I do well. know it is at Cumberland Park at the War Memorial there in that little area, that amphitheater. We did this last year, and it was phenomenal. The Lord just uh, just blessed that event, um, and we are claiming and believing that, uh, that that's going to happen again this year. Absolutely. So if you are going to bring those school supplies, we ask that you please bring them by July 29th. Which is a week from tomorrow, believe it or not. What time does that start, Angie? Do you know, Pastor Joel? I'm not praying? sure what time it starts, okay. but we'll check out Church Center app, and it will tell you what time we're doing worship in the park on August the 2nd. It is a Friday night. Okay, guys, listen. We literally have something going on every night of the we week we here at Real Life, and I'm really excited about that. We have a men's group that meets here on Monday nights. Uh, six. Chris, what time does that start? Six o'clock? 6.30, get here by 6, and you're good. Tuesday is our prayer gathering. On Tuesdays, what we do is we spend time praying for what's coming up for the week. We've prayed for healing. Miss Holly, Absolutely. you've been to that service. Absolutely, and it is a very powerful, uh, powerful event, guys. Uh, if you are needing healing in your life or you know someone that is needing healing uh, prayers, please come to that. Um, you just, uh, you will leave blessed. And uh, it's been wonderful. Tuesday nights at 6 o'clock. And on Wednesdays, Wednesdays we have Battleground Recovery. Where are you at? Right up in here, up in here. Who Holly, tell ashamed? us about, oh, tell Battle us about Battleground. The Battleground Recovery starts at 6 p.m. on Wednesdays. And uh, it is just a phenomenal opportunity to come and fellowship with, uh, with fellow believers and uh, try to lead others to the cross um, and just uh, be set free in the Lord's goodness. And uh, food starts at 6 o'clock, and we start worship at 6.30, and then we'll break out into some groups. We also have, where is our youth up in here? Eric, Eric. Woo, woo. Impact uh, our youth groups, and that is for junior six, high. Six oh. through 12th graders. If okay. you're going into 6th through 12th grade, um, you also can eat with us at 6. We have Kid Life Connect yes. at 6 o'clock. And Holly, is Battleground just for people who struggle with drug addiction? Oh, absolutely not. Battleground is for anybody dealing with anything. Hurts, habits, hang-ups, things you've done. That was, that was a tough one for me, coming to realization of all the things that I had done. <laughs> so uh, just, just come. Uh, it's for everyone. Absolutely. So make sure you get here on six o'clock at, on at six o'clock on Wednesdays yes. for dinner and then something literally for the entire family. And some of us may think, oh, I don't need battleground. I'm good. But I promise <laughs> you'll probably find something out about yourself you didn't know. That's right. You're on you the battleground to do oh. that. But yeah. and listen, guys, with all of this stuff that's going on, we need you. 
We can't do this without our wonderful volunteers. And so all of the things that you've heard about coming up this week, we need you to help us make those things happen. So make sure when you're on our website or our church center app, if there's something that catches your eye that you want to help volunteer with, please let us know. There is a place for you here. We are a family, and as a family, you know each person has their role, and that's the same way in the church family. Wednesday nights, man, for everybody to have a, a meal together as a family, we need people to help cook and prepare and do all those things. Here at Real Life, we want everyone to be involved, and so if you want to be involved, we want to plug you in. Absolutely. Holly, is there anything else we need to talk about today that you can think of? I don't know. Do you guys feel anything? I just want to let you know in case you don't know that he is in the room this morning. Amen. He is in the room. And uh, he told me this morning to expect magnificent things. And I've already Ooh. seen magnificent things walk through the door today. Amen. So God is so good. He is he so good. Is. 